Regarding these spills, I'm proposing complicity on the part of Mayor Wade Hibbard. You see, Hibbard owns 50 shares in Schlumberg, who's owned by Exico, the beast of the bottomless pit. Emulsifex. Therefore, Hibbard made money on the clean. <laughs>
energy, even physical matter. So maybe, if we all focus our minds on the destruction of this unholy weapon, it will happen.
responds out of fear for the sovereignty of the United States and Earth itself. Like heroic Neo, the shark has freed us from the Matrix. Now, we can unplug from the metal coils that once enslaved us, leave our mechanical caves, and greet this new dawn of truth. It's been 90 days since my last Truth Quest broadcast. I'm sure a lot of you are wondering where I've been. Well, for the past year or so, I've been partaking daily of ayahuasca. In fact, the very concept of Truth Quest came to me during a powerful, a powerful vision. vision. It was during my last vidcast that I experienced what my wife described as a psychotic break. The next day, she and my son Stephen staged a family intervention. Well, I'm happy to report that since then, I've filed for divorce. Now I have time to dedicate myself to my true home. Questers, we know that reality is just a mirage. Somewhere through the crack between time and space, great cosmic truths remain, still awaiting discovery. These are the obscure and unmarked points along the road of our truth quest. <laughs>